Hey guys, I'm Egg. And I'm Rosan. And we're back. Uh, we're we I can we've, like taste the finish line, but I'm not 100 percent sure exactly. Yeah, we have no idea. Uh, we had a ton of little pod things come up. So, like in the last episode, like we we took like a few second break after uh, this one. Like we're still playing in the same recession, but we took a small little break because the doggy really needed to go poo poo. And uh, we were thinking like, how did all the eggs and shit get here? And um, we did the worst thing you can do. We assumed, and you know what they say about people who assume, you make an ass out of you and me. That's true. And we always figure, you know, after that facehugger latch onto that girl in that uh, beginning, that they probably just like rushed back to get her medical attention. But we didn't think like, oh, maybe either A, a scientist, or B, greedy as fuck. So a scientist would be like, oh no, to figure out what this thing did to her, would probably want to take an egg and examine it to see what happened. Oh my god, open up. Our multiple... While the greedy bastard would be like, well, I'm not leaving here without a payload, blah, 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 blah. And it probably took him with it. So we're guessing that's probably how all this got to the Sevastopol. Yeah. So. Probably, uh, yeah. We're now heading to medical. We have absolutely no idea why. Yeah. <laughs> they just said to go to medical. Yeah, apparently. The uh, med power. Yeah, apparently uh, resetting the power core like we did. Reset has, everything. Yeah, so. Don't know why that means we need to go to medical, though. And uh, we counted at least, what, five xenomorphs yeah, five, running five away? Five or six, yeah. So. <laughs> Damn. I had to keep that flamethrower, bro. It's an event. So, uh, it also looks like... Please don't be in the event. That's exactly... You're not even in the right spot. Oh my god. Oh, look. You have a revolver equipped and not a flamethrower. Okay. Oh, is it there? Nope. You have to call it. No. It... Fuck. There's a vent uh, thing right beside you. There's not one. Across from you? To oh. your left. Oh, thank god. There you go. I like how when it's open, that means you can't hide in it at all. Yeah, what kind of fucking bullshit is that? That's more funny than anything. But, uh... So, yeah, we're still on our way to medical. But, uh... Ooh, this has been one hell of a day. Like, experience-wise, there's a ton of stuff. There's now xenomorphs probably pretty much everywhere. Yeah. And, well, I got here pretty quickly. Here's the thing, though. What are they going to do with that? Are they going to still leave it where it's a single xenomorph stalking you, or are they going to have a situation where one or two could be around each other? Oh, dude, I have no idea. I really have no idea. Like, they could do a lot of possibility now that they have multiple in here that could be either, like, hellishly annoying yeah. or extremely cool to see. And by what I mean extremely cool to see is an... Um, I can't remember which alien movie it was. I think it was the futuristic one where they were cloning Ripley's. The third. No, that would be the fourth, I think. I can't remember. But remember how they used to keep them locked up in cages? And eventually one of them got smart and they killed its friend? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, what? it would be interesting if they got in a situation where these things could fight each other. I doubt they're going to do that. I seriously don't Can see that. Okay, uh. To transit to control. control. Oh. So, this way. Yeah. So, another word, we're getting in an ambulance? Or at least an ambulance shuttle. Yeah. So, we're getting a Marlowe ship now. Here's the thing, though the Anisadora. Is Wait. there anything on there? Oh, fuck. It, there, yeah. Not, how did these get here in the first place? His he had ship. had to have brought him here in his ship. Yeah. So there's a very good chance this is like... What's a good way to put it? Uh, remember Starship Troopers? Yes. This is like the meteor that travels with all the bugs. Oh, yeah. That's what potentially we're going into. This door, maybe? 
Uh, maybe through there. Yep. Ooh. It's funny, we're calming down now, but the truth is, this is where it's actually the most tense. <laughs> because oh, yeah. this is, this this really feels like it's it. Oh, yeah. I have a feeling you go left. I'm going to be mad if I'm in the wrong area. I don't think you are. Or, yes. Well, transit control. There it is. Is that where we're headed? No, the ambulance is in. I think you go to that big explanation point. It's still in the right spot. See right there? Oh, yeah. Okay, that looks like an elevator, maybe? That was the one that was broken, too. Remember? Oh, yeah, yeah. We were here a while back. The backtracking is real. <sighs> this really feels like a calm. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. This this really... Like calm before the storm? Yeah, that calm. But I think this... No, this isn't even a new area. Okay. Um, mm. All the way left? <laughs> you go all the way across. But... Fuck. Okay. Oh, it's dark. Is this where you started? I believe it could very well be. Door locked. Uh, well, where does that lead me to be able to go? Right. Shit. That's... Fuck, man. I think I gotta go back. No, I, I don't think you... Oh, okay. I think we're we're good now. Oh, we were on the wrong floor. I, I guess so. Maybe. Knowing our luck, when we go back to watch this, we'll have just gone the wrong fucking direction. That's funny. Okay. Uh, so it looks like straight across. So that one's barred. So maybe the left side. Yeah. Okay. Try to be careful, because we know that thing can kill you here. From my personal experience. Oh yeah. Okay. There. Plasma torch door. Yep, okay. You heard that too, right? I did. So I'm trying to be very, very careful. <laughs> you get the loud ass torch. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yep, I'm well aware. I hear the noise. I am. Um, I wonder if, though if that noise is because there's an the alien there, or that thing started swinging because you cut it off. Who knows? Like, do you think they went in that much detail where any kind of noise will set it off? Well, I mean, lore-wise, we now know they're used to track rats, so. And pests, yeah, which is very interesting, because that, I, let's be honest, I think everyone's been kind of wondering why the fuck that thing's there, because I mean, it wouldn't work in a war too well because everyone knows it's there so they would know they just have to stop moving or have someone run in one direction like literally one person can just do a dance in a corner and distract yeah. but rats make like a tremendous amount of sense because I can I can imagine rats are in oh look it's this fucking room again this is the room that they blew up yeah who did Marlo the guy the prisoner Oh. But yeah, I imagine rats can be absolutely devastating on a on a fucking thing in space. You know what I mean? Oh yeah, when they freaking eat wires, controls, they could probably short circuit everything and destroy everyone. Being a pest guy is probably like probably a good job, funny enough. Alright, uh Map it. <laughs> map it, yep. <laughs> I saw one. Woo yeah. Woohoo! Okay. <laughs> Shit. Okay, so I gotta go out and then up. Looks like left. So this way? Yeah. <sighs> yeah, this is the room I think that we had the CGI. Really this is this is the room with the cutscene where it blew up. And this is where oh, like yeah. I had my conniption fits and shit. This is the room that broke this is the area of the map that broke me. Like I, I know this, this better than anything. Like, I recognize that map because I stared at it for three fucking hours. Like, this is what, like, broke me of this game, where I, like, I don't really want to play it anymore. You ain't going that way, dog. Oh, god damn it. 
You're taking a long way. Fucking shit. It's not that bad, though. Remember, you do have a flamethrower. All you have to, it's just straight circle. Yeah, the good news about this hallway is there's lots of places to hide, at least. Like, I think there are aliens here, but I don't think they're being as aggressive as they were. Is this a shortcut or anything? No, I think no. that's where you got, like, one of the items. And that's where the doctor was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You do have a flamethrower equipped, yes. Okay. Alright, he's beeping. Oh, fuck. That's a goddamn android. That does make this a lot more awkward. Because we can't get into a fight with that thing. We absolutely cannot. Shit. And I'm way too afraid to use, like, noisemakers and shit. No, we can't use them. And there's right here. Now, here. Bring up your map. But there's a safe station on the left. Yeah, you know what that safe station is? That's the save station where... I know what it is. Yeah, where, where you had your Steve moment. Yep, yeah, where I, like, started worshipping. And you know what happened last time we moved in that station? We were station? there for about an hour. Yes. <laughs> uh, trust me. You didn't have to rewatch the footage. Like, even I stopped after a while. I'm like, I really, like, started breaking down. Like, I will admit it. This game, like... The constant stress of being stuck, like... This... Like, I'm glad you're here, because I'm glad I could experience this game, but I know I could never play it. Just because, I, I think I mentioned this in an earlier episode, but one of my biggest fears is being stalked. Well. And not being able to defend myself. Like, that drives me absolutely crazy. And this game is literally the embodiment of that. I know, but what other choice do I have? I, know. I think it's slow enough or it won't fa run. So you can walk it. Oh god, is that it? Uh, You're really close. You nope. gotta go straight okay. into the four way. Don't walk underneath those things. It ain't worth it. Alright, that's a plus. Okay, and then left. God, I hate looking at medical. Yeah, so many memories. You know what? <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> okay, okay uh, folks, what you just missed is oh. Egg's chair, the little lock that stops it from oh leaning back, just popped out. So he almost just did a backflip. <laughs> yeah, holy shit. Okay, uh... I th maybe? No. You have to upgrade it. Wait, flashbang? Oh no! Straight up. Oh no, there it is. <laughs> Find a level 3 version of Access Turner. Either whip out your map or the radar, it'll show you. Is that it? That is it. Are you kidding? That was nice and short. <laughs> okay, never mind. Nope. One second, guys. And we're back. Doggy emergency was over. Yep. Okay. Where the fuck am I going now? Uh, back to the door. Yep. Okay. Let's see what the new game is. Are they going to actually give me a new game? You know, a part of me actually wouldn't have been surprised if they saved a single game up until now. Oh, it does go by fucking quick, though. Holy shit. Okay. Well, it's supposed to be the hard mode. Okay, so boom, ba -dum, boom, boom, ba -dum, boom, 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 boom. Fuck! Dude, you only have one more time. I know. I that, don't know what happens if you get three detections. Do something you? tells me it's gonna make a huge ass alarm noise or something. Okay, because this is. Oh, okay. Apparently I didn't do anything. That's actually kind of funny. What? What's the point of the three times thing? I honestly don't know, bro. Whew. 
I honestly don't understand why they give you three times if it literally just lets you immediately start it again. He's sacrificing himself. Or we're bringing something out with us. Yeah, one or the other. I'm expecting to see a Xeno on the other side of that glass. Me too, in a way. Oh, you still got full control? Uh, at least visually, yeah. That is very cool looking. Oh, it's super cool. We're going to be on Marlow's ship now. Yes? Uh, I think we're just in space. But that's where we're heading, it's Marlow's, right? I believe so. Yep, we're on Marlow. <laughs> dot, 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 indeed. Oh, wait, hit the map again? Anisadora. The Anisadora. Okay. So we are officially in Marlowe's land. Now, we don't know what's here. Yeah, no, not at all. We don't know if there's a Xeno. Oh, god damn it. That I hit no. Yeah, you hit no. Bring the Anisadora system back online. Hmm... Sure. Why not? Yeah, just start going. <laughs> not gonna lie, this kind of looked like a weird Xeno statue from like way back. Oh yeah, it it's does, like doesn't it? Shape. Yeah. yeah. Even down to their rib cages. Yeah, holy shit. That was an intention of the design. Like you're walking around like it's all cool, but <laughs> like Yeah. I think that's the girl that died. I think it is, too. So she really did feel it in her bones in the end. Yeah, she felt the rip out of her bones. Damn. I wonder if we can get a firefight with Marlo. Is that fine for thorough fuel? Can't shotgun, shotgun shells. shells. But did it say flame fuel? I believe it did, yeah. Oh yeah, top that shit off. Okay, and then check down. You don't have to match it, buddy. Listen, man, it's stressful times. There's not stress going on yet. <laughs> LM Link. Oh, look at that. Ain't that a trick? says he's just picked up some kind of signal. I've got Lewis trying to decode it now. Could be the Nostromo. Want to come up and see for yourself. Let's see. A technician's report that says uh, much needed work on the sublight engines. Uh, everything's holding together. 
4510. Anyway, I had to reset the dorky code 4510. Okay. 0.510. These guys are really bad with security codes. Like, everyone in space is stupid. Yeah, it's they just leave them lying around. computers right near it. Yeah. So that was Marlo's wife. The 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 poor woman that started it all. Yeah. That sucks. But you think Marlo would be act a little bit different than he did in that cell. Like, he didn't seem like a grieving husband, you know what I mean? Yeah, no, not at all. I think you gotta let that shit finish powering on, maybe I'll lock the door. There we go. Hmm. That answered that question. That was, uh... There we go. Okay. Okay. At least that was a little bit easier. Oh, yeah. Considerably easier. Everything's now waiting on things to get done moving. <laughs> I mean, hey, uh, kudos to sticking to it. Ricardo, in case you're hearing me, I've got the news of one's basic power systems back. All right. Doors should be open. Hopefully it's in light. There's still no sign of one. That way? I guess. Or is this where I was just at? This is where you just were. Oh. He turned it off himself. The question is... Why? Yeah. Was it really for, like, Was something was actually broken, or... I think... Oh. Find Marlo. I'm thinking you go up a deck. No, look, hurt Because... A door, oh, so where are you going, man? Yeah. What is he planning? Like, is he really a bad guy? Like, they just seem like salvagers. I mean, being a salvager doesn't. Why am I? <laughs> Maybe I am robot racist because I'm trying to defend this guy. <laughs> Has a bunch of them in here. Damn. Can't believe there's face suckers in. So that means there's. There's eggs. There's eggs, yep. Shit. It's a radio. Weird. Figured there'd be something to that. Uh, personal log, whatever was attached itself. Foster is dead. From the floor in oh, the like bed, it all come up and swear. Foster says she can't find that sleep. Putting her in hyper sleep. Quarantine we were pulling, but I figured this drama flat recorder. So they froze her that they did Ripley when she wasn't dead. Remember? Because Ripley did the same thing and put the thing to sleep. Elisa Dora, this is hmm. Marshall Waits of Sebastopol. Hmm. Officially, I should deny your request to dock. Sebastopol is currently being decommissioned, and I can't compromise security for unscheduled vessels. However, in the light of the property you found, I will allow a small number of your crew to dock via a short-range shuttle. I must remind you that Sebastopol is entitled to a cut of any reward for return of said property once it's on station. Let me know your decision. Wait up. Well, now we know how they got on board. Greed. Hmm. The downfall of many a thing. Okay. Which would be a plus. It has its ups and downs. Yeah. It means you always want more, which is bad, but it always means you... Well, if you're an honest person, you always work harder to get things because you're greedy. Which is kind of a weird, like, you know, circle of self-hate, maybe? <laughs> Being so greedy, keep going for things. Wow, this thing's freaking rattling apart. 
Yes, it is. Okay, so we we kind of agree with him there. True, but, but his, that being said, doesn't mean he needs to kill the innocent people. Like, well, he doesn't know who's infected. That's true. He doesn't. Because technically, when you're infected, it doesn't mean you're instantly dead. We've learned that from other people who haven't been infected, and it takes like a little bit for it to kick in. Very true. You're looking at that vent. Mm-hmm. I don't know if there's a big one here. I don't know either, but... I don't think there'd be a big one. I mean, where there's facehuggers. That doesn't mean... Because a facehugger can't grow into a big one, though. That's the thing. Not on its own, it can't. You're right. Yeah, because I'm going this way. So only way to go. Power core. What is he doing? I think he's gonna blow up his ship into this festival. If you flat recorder data? Oh, that must be the ship for his mom her mom. Oh, is it? Oh. you get to hear it one day you see I um, I got into trouble um, my ship there was an accident sweetheart and um, we found an alien creature it was very dangerous and the only way we could stop it was to destroy the ship uh, I'm okay I'm stuck on this lifeboat long way out but we had to destroy the ship. We had to destroy the Nostromo. We just couldn't risk bringing that thing home with us. I needed to protect you. Don't worry. Don't worry about me. I'm sure I'll see you very soon. I love you, sweetheart. Damn. Hmm. But you know he listened to that, and you know he probably got the same idea about destroying the ship. Yeah, probably. Oh God. Don't know if that's a curse or closure. Mm. Especially for a parent. Oh. oh. The thing. The, no, no, on the wall. On the wall, to the left. You'll destroy the ship and the station. He's right. There has to be something here. Listen to me! Oh. We don't have to do this! Stop! Stop it, mother! It's gonna be just like the same note. Open the fusion systems. 
so I can work on them. What? I need power sent to the auxiliary generator. Look for the letters A U X. Auxiliary. <laughs> Hit it. Oh, there it is. Yeah, I do one at a time. It's the mini game extravaganza. <laughs> You gotta do the hacking. Come on, Taylor. I find it funny the final big moments done through mini games. Yeah, for real. Uh, v. You know, I know we're trying to stop him from killing us, but part of me kind of like is on the same boat as him. Mm. You know what I mean? Yeah. But then again, dying means you can't stop it in the future. Uh, Taylor, I would get away from that. You know, for someone who was badly injured, she's still moving around pretty well. Yeah. You know, she kind of did part of this for herself. Uh, Get out I'm of sorry, it. Taylor. Oh, shit. Oh, well, at least you, the gauge is nice enough to guide you to where you need to go. Yeah, let's hope, because honestly, this is a blind fucking run. Well, this... There's always been parts of this that have been blind from the beginning, let's be honest. Either from me playing, and you playing later on. Yep. Going this way. Oh, shit. Come on, Ripley. Whoa. What? Oh, did the gravity shut off? No. Those statues right there, that machinery, Yeah. that got me for a second, because it looks so much like an alien. Oh, yeah. Ooh. The message. We're not back on this vessel, are we? We are. Lovely. You know what kills me? She technically stayed in that fucking ship and just went to the Torrens? This would be over. Yeah. She changed her tone from like, oh no, we are always to hear this long and then leaving. <laughs> How was that? that was an incorrect code. Apparently. Okay. Uh V platforms. Upside down F weird O. <laughs> <laughs> Damn that thing moves quick. No, yeah, you're at the high level game now, technically. Okay. And Ricardo. Right there on your right. Mm -hmm. Remember, we're back in alien territory, though. Oh, yeah. But we do technically have a full-powered Ripley. As full-powered as you can get, I guess I would be That's true. I kind of wish we had a little more flamethrower fuel, but... Things considered. Yeah.
Yeah, yeah, whatever. Okay. Uh, uh, I have no idea. Check the different floors. He is on communications. So uh, yeah, he said he. Oh, so it looks like he's on the floor. I don't we know. gotta go. Elevator, maybe? The reception room? Hang on. So, this is where he's at. What is the name of this floor? Observation deck, I guess? Yeah. Okay. But so, look, hit one more time. And again. Boom. Central communications. That's where he's at. Okay. So, we need to go to, I guess, comms control? Well, he's going up. Like, he looks like he's on the top floor, is he not? I, okay, so well, where do I fucking go, man? I was guessing the elevator. Like right there at that elevator? Yeah. Here. Oh, there we go. Just do that. <laughs> Problem solved. There you go. Woo! We keep forgetting we can. <laughs> what? Seriously. Can they? Well, there's fucking armed humans. Where'd they come from? Apparently, I mean, they've been on the station the whole time. They've just been hiding. Fuck. Okay. Um, Fuck. Okay. Wait, I know where you're at. Go through that door on the left. Turn. There should be a plasma cutting wall somewhere. Go left again. Oh, it's open. I think that's the one where we were on the other side. Yeah, but see what it does? It takes you all the way around. I know this. I did this part. Okay, so... You can go right. Wow, kind of funny how, like, all those old experiences of hiding have kind of been I mean, playing dang. off. Like... Okay. So. Oh, wait a minute. On your right. That way? Yeah. Because I don't ever remember going through that door. Is there a guy over there? Then I can tell. Let's get to that there's elevator. a guy over there, and there's a guy right there. Oh, he's padding towards you. Maybe if you go... No. no Let's say maybe if you go fast enough, you could have gotten past. I mean, well... I wouldn't want to do it just yet. I would hold off, because if they're here, they're going to probably be on other levels, too. I think the elevator is their current goal, and then... Which should be good. Oh, these are stairs at the end, is there? Oh, good, there is. Because God knows you can't climb anything in this game. <laughs> or walk sideways okay. on stairs. <laughs> Where's the alien when you need it? Yeah, seriously. Because we know there's a shit ton of them. Okay. This is the right way, right? Yeah. Like, check VP. It is. Do I look like someone you should fuck with, bitch? Okay, can we laugh at that real quick? <laughs> like, that's fucking funny. Yeah, I don't know how I survived that, because I fucking, I sure as fuck shouldn't have. Like, he flat out looked at you. Oh, there is no elevator, there's just stairs. Yeah, he looked at me and threatened me. And I just proceeded to beat the shit out of him. Can we abuse that? <laughs> um, I don't know. I don't know if it just worked because of how close I got to him before he saw me. Okay. Because that's what he did. Like, I don't know if you heard him. Yeah. But he gave me a fucking countdown warning. Okay. Well, uh, apparently th we're not on the last part. Uh, but stay tuned. Yeah, Hopefully. we're almost there. We're, we're almost, almost there. there. We're just running a little bit long. So, okay. uh, anyway, I'm Rosan. And I'm Egg. And uh, stay beautiful, guys. And we are so freaking close. I taste it. I know. All right, guys. See you. Bye-bye.